remarkably, uh, you know, the prevalence now of Alzheimer's greater than cancer, the mortality of the disease greater than COVID, and yet still not recognized as a pandemic. We can actually uh, build scalable tools that can lead to better diagnosis and hopefully prevention as well um, in lower risk of settings. So I live in hope and I continue to be an optimist and I hope to see it in my lifetime. And I think it's extremely important that you listen to people who live with the condition and that we are part, we are more than part. We are the essential part of the whole problem. To create a society where living with dementia is possible and positive. You know, dementia is a societal issue. It needs to be looked at in that way. And, you know, I think what makes dementia different, or one of the elements that makes it different, is the, you know, for example, the huge informal care cost. With our global ageing population, the numbers are going to triple in the coming years. It's more than a medical problem, it's a societal problem. We want to make sure that whatever we develop and in, 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 uh, try to implement, uh, that is very anchored in the communities that we serve. And so I think it's important for us to recognise that no health system is prepared unless it's prepared for all. And so we need to figure out a way to build this into our work. It's just unacceptable in today's day and age for a patient to be left behind without the support that their family needs or that they need. So there is some innovative work going on in the diagnostic field, which you'll hear a lot about at this conference, to say how do we drive uh, the detection and diagnosis of this disease into primary care, because in most countries of the world, there aren't many neurologists, let alone PET scans. My appeal to you is don't be strangers, do engage because our opinion matters and we all in our way are influencers, not just in our workplaces but also in our families and in our communities. So we need to stick together on this because the problem we have outside this room is giant.